Hello to everyone. This is Gunter Steiner. This is Speed City. Welcome back to the fastest hour in radio, Speed City. Yeah, but, but Linus, I, I mean, this Indy Lights path that you chose, I mean, you could have chosen other paths, right? I mean, you were on, uh, you know, you were in, you weren't in the the USF ladder first of all. You were in the USF four or F three, the FR Americas. And were you thinking that you would go the Formula One path, maybe go to Europe rather than go the Indy path? I mean, that that was the plan from from the very beginning. Obviously, growing up in Europe and, and racing in Europe and, and karting, that was kind of the target that we had. Um, and I did British F4, British F3, and then the Euro F3, Euro Formula Championship. Um, and we did well. I mean, we won the, the British F3 Championship and had a pretty good season in, in Euro Formula. Uh, but we just didn't have the the funding and the budget to go to any further than that. Um, and then I was looking at every kind of option that I had. And then um, obviously I heard about the scholarships that, that you guys over have over here in, in the U.S., which was very interesting to me. Um, so on a last minute deal, um, I, I was able to um, to do the, the FR championship. And I didn't have a, a budget to do the full year. I was able to do half of it. And then we won the first eight races. And then yeah. I got a little bit of money from back home. And when, then with the help from the team, they said, yeah, all right, let's continue this, see where it goes. <laughs> and then we won the, the championship. I got the scholarship to do in the lights last year. Um, and then with the results that we had last year, we was able to string together a season this year as well. So, yeah, it's um, I say that now that never, ever in my career have I had a deal done before Christmas. And I'm hoping that I can change it for this year. Uh, would be nice to go into the holidays with a little bit more secure ground. I know what I'm doing next year, but we'll see. Linus, just explain to our audience, because obviously the route to Formula One, and you are now qualified, um, is, 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 is somewhat complicated to people and they don't necessarily understand. But the point is, America, and when I look down the list of Indy Lights drivers, you know, the top three, well, Brabham is an American, but he's an Australian, really. Hunter McElroy is a New Zealander and you're from Sweden. I mean, the opportunity to win, just talk about what Honda have given you as a European driver that you couldn't get having won the prestigious F3 championship in Britain? Um, yeah, I mean, the, the, it's the way that the American racing scene does does racing or the junior series, I would say. That's the biggest difference because from anything that I won back back home in, in Scandinavia or, or the UK, you won the title, but you never got anything for it more than the, obviously, the, the glory and, and, and the prestigious from it. Um, but over here in the US, you have the, the road to Indy and then you had the F bar. And that's when, when Honda announced that they supported that series and got their scholarship, which was very interesting to me. Because obviously Honda and HPD is a brand that you wouldn't mind having a connection with. Um, and that they were able to put money towards um, uh, a year in, in Indy Lights. And without that, that support from Honda, I wouldn't be where I am today. So uh, that was you know, 98% of the reason why we, why we chose to go here to the U S because we, we thought that, Hey, if, if I can win this championship, then we might have a chance go, going forward. Hey, Adam, 